Steam pumper fire engines were used by fire departments between the mid-19th and early 20th centuries. Like a modern fire engine, steam pumpers carried tanks of water, but this water was not meant for spraying on fire. Instead, the tank holding the water was a coal-fire boiler used to power the engine's dual-piston water pump. Water from an external reservoir, such as a hydrant, river, or pond, would be drawn into the pump through a rigid hose and out through a long leader hose. Waltham Engine No. 1 is a first-class double-plunger engine and served from 1871 until the 1930s. It had the highest flow rate of any pumper engine manufactured until the 1950s at 850 gallons per minute and was drawn by a team of horses. When the Great Fire of 1872 broke out, engine number one was dispatched to Boston on a flat car railway carriage to help combat the inferno. It was built by the Amistead Locomotive Works in 1871 and donated to the museum from the collection of W. H. Nichols, who purchased it after its retirement.